Hey everyone, it's uh, Reclaimer, and I'm going to do a short little video because I feel like making a video. Uh, winter time is coming here in Pennsylvania, so I'm going to be moving my small utility trailer that I have for my four-wheeler. I'm going to actually be moving that um, into the backyard area so I have the driveway free uh, for snow plowing. Uh, and I'm going to, I figured, you know, I'm going to move this today. I'm going to demonstrate the Ford uh Pro trailer backup assist, whatchamacallit. So uh, let me go ahead and show you what we're working with. So there is my 2016 F 150. Uh, this is a 2.6 liter twin turbo um, V6 EcoBoost. And then here is the little utility trailer, I believe it's an 8x10. You can see here uh, that we have the sticker already set up for it, and that's going to be used for the Pro Trailer Backup Assist. Um, yeah, it's going to be a quick little video. I'm going to go ahead and get started. So the trailer is now connected and we're going to go ahead and start the truck and show you kind of how this works. So let's start it up. All right, so the first thing it's going to notice that a trailer is connected because I connected the harness. Um, it's also going to tell me that my blind spot and cross traffic alert is deactivated due to the trailer being attached. I'm just going to hit OK. And it automatically brings up my 5x10 utility trailer information uh, that I have already set up in the system when I set up the Pro, uh, the Pro Trailer Backup Assist. Uh, if I go down the towing, it's going to tell me that my running and brake lights are connected. And I can do a connection checklist if I want. All right, I think we're good to go. Uh, everything looks good on the mirrors. I'm going to take the parking brake off. We're going to put her into drive. Uh, the trailer has been connected already by this point. So let's go ahead and pull forward. Open my windows here, just because why not? All right, and so far, everything is looking really good. This is a really easy uh, trailer to drive. It's so small. All right, so this is basically the wide turn that we make and we're going in my yard. <laughs> Gotta love it. <clears throat> I bought this trailer last year at Lowe's. Uh, I'll be honest with you, it's not the best quality trailer uh, out there, but it was reasonably priced. And uh, I really only use it, I used it only once to transport my four-wheeler. I mean, it's good to have, especially when you're doing yard projects and stuff like that. Uh, and then I usually park it back here uh, in the winter, so that way I don't have to deal with, you know, other stuff. <laughs> 
uh, mainly uh, the snow plow getting in the way. So I'm gonna go ahead, this is gonna be a really easy backup video for this tro pro trailer backup assist. I'm just doing my best to straighten the trailer out. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and hit the uh, pro trailer backup. I'm gonna select the five by 10 utility. And if we take a look at my backup screen here, it's locating the sticker, which is right here. And it says, all right, go ahead and shift into reverse to activate. So I'm gonna do that. I have my hands off the steering wheel and I'm going to back up slowly using my foot pedals. Um, so accelerate and brake, obviously. And then I'm gonna use this knob here to turn in the direction that I wanna go. Uh, so right now it's looking like I need to go uh, a little bit over to the right. So I'm gonna go ahead and start doing that now. And I'm gonna let the vehicle do my steering for me and I'm watching the trailer in my right mirror right now. I wanna try getting it close to the property line. Okay, I'm gonna let it straighten out. Let my truck do the work for me. So far it's looking pretty good. I'm right about where I need to be. Let me just check. Hmm. Yeah, I'd say I'm pretty good. And it, it, it's that simple. Um, so now if I needed to stop, I could go into drive and move forward and it's gonna deactivate and it's gonna say go back into, uh, you know, uh, go back into reverse to activate it. I don't really need to do that right now. What I'm gonna do is actually turn this off because I'm done with it. Go into park, put my parking brake on and uh, let's go ahead and check how it did. Again, this is really easy. This is probably the least complicated setup ever. I'm gonna leave my engine on just in case we need to move it. Yeah, this is perfectly fine. Um, uh, yeah, this is perfectly fine. I'm gonna leave it here like this. So I'm gonna go ahead now and disconnect it. All right, that was about it. Uh, like I said, wasn't gonna be a really crazy video of me, you know, towing a boat and backing up into a boat launch and all this other stuff. Um, <clears throat> really, it was just a quick little video to show you how I hook up my small eight by 10 utility trailer, uh, five by 10, yeah. <laughs> uh, how I hook that up and then, wow, I'm fogging up here. How I hook that up and then uh, how real quickly the pro trailer backup assist works um i know a lot of people say oh if you don't know how to back up a trailer the traditional way or if you can't or if you won't back up a trailer the traditional way then you shouldn't be towing i understand that uh, but i mean this is a really in my opinion it's a really easy safe way to get your trailer where you want it and allows you to minimize the additional brain work that you need um, when you're when you're backing a trailer so that you can really be focusing on where your trailer is going and your surroundings so that you don't have to worry about uh, colliding with a pedestrian or a fixed object or you know another vehicle um, so I, I think that this is a great tool I mean sure yeah you want to be able to back up your trailer if you don't have this a lot of trucks don't have something like this um, it's pretty unique to Ford but hey it came with the vehicle I figured why not use it it was really easy to set up it's it's really great to use uh, I'm a fan. So if you like this video and you want to see something else with my Ford or with my uh, Audi, uh, let me know uh, in the comments. So that's about it. This is Reclaimer. We'll see you around.